Good morning. Today we're going to look at a posterior chain exercise. It's really quite a challenge and there's lots of aspects to it, but it's really worthwhile. So if we start from our feet upwards, we'll go through the first few components. So the first component you're going to do for me is you're going to squeeze your heels together and you're going to squeeze your glute heels. Now the next part of that is to posteriorly tilt your pelvis and try and lift your stomach off the ground. So if I exaggerate the tilt for you, so that's anterior tilt. And what we want you to do is go the opposite way. So you're going to go that way. So you're going to go, that's not what we want you to do. We want you to go that way. So let's go over them. So you're going to squeeze your heels together, squeeze your glutes. I posteriorly tilt my pelvis and lift my tummy, my lower tummy off the mat. The last component is bringing in our arms. Now you can just take your arms out to the side. I prefer to use some form of resistance band for this. And with this part, what you're going to do is with your neck in a nice neutral position, you're going to take your arms out to the side and lift out and out. Okay, so we will put all of those together. So, Starting from our heels, we're going to squeeze our heels together, we're going to squeeze, squeeze our glutes, we're going to posteriorly tilt our pelvis, lifting our stomach off the ground, we're going to lift our arms out to the side, bring our shoulder blades down and back, and hold that. Okay, we'll do that once more, so again, squeezing our heels together, squeezing our glutes as we Posteriorly tilt our pelvis and lift our arms up and out to the side. Whew. So it's pretty hard going, but you will reap lots of great benefits from it. Thank you very much.